Hello everyone. It's a real pleasure to see such a large audience in Barcelona today. And uh, first, I would like, if you're okay, to give another round of huge applause for the product launch team and all the 250 people at Towns of that are working so hard all year long to make it happen. Please. <laughs> so before starting my keynote, I would like to call on stage a special guest, someone that came specially for you guys from Seattle. We have been working together for months now, and we are writing, currently writing, a story. One of those that can really change the HCM game. One of those that can make you proud, that can make you happy. That's the story that led us to this build moment that was an incredible moment for all of us. And this story we are writing right now is really strong because when you got two companies with their mission so aligned, yes, magic can happen as Nicola Gom was saying. So please, I ask you to welcome on stage with a very warm welcome, Ben Summers from Microsoft. with all 
the data and all the insights and all the signal that's underneath uh, a Microsoft 365 tenant. This fabric that contains all that data is what we call the Microsoft graph. And this is a very, very important concept because, you know, when we're working on this stuff at Microsoft, we're not just thinking about this in the context of, well, how do we make Microsoft products better? We're actually thinking about how we can extend these capabilities to our partners and to our customers, right? We want to make sure that this data is available uh, to all of these folks, and we invest a huge amount of resources in making that possible. The result of that is that we produce endpoints uh, for this extensibility that are based on open standards. So if you're a programmer, these would be REST-based API standards. And I think beyond that, we want to always make sure that what we've got is grounded in this idea that our connections are secure, that they are compliant, and that there are governance and management capabilities that go along with these things uh, that our developers uh, can access. Now, um, because we make this investment, it does in fact turn out that there are thousands upon thousands of companies that are building graph-connected products either for their internal use or to sell on the market. And this is a very, very powerful idea. But I would tell you today that most of the applications that people are actually developing using this technology are, I think I would probably call them transactional or perhaps point-in-time applications that allow you to you know, get information based upon what you need at any given moment. We keep hearing, though, from customers, and I think we hear, especially from customers probably like yourselves, that there's a lot more that people want to be able to get out of their data, right? People want to be able to get not just information, but they want to get deep insights. They want to be able to take all the data that their organization produces, say, in Office 365, and combine that data with, for example, HR data. And then it becomes extremely relevant to you, right? This is all the data about what people are actually doing in your organization, combined with the information that you yourselves have about organizations. This can be extremely rich. So what we're seeing then is a demand for something that we would call insight applications. And Insight applications really present, I think, a different challenge. They present the challenge of needing to work with very, very large data sets. You don't just look at point-in-time information. You look at information over a whole span of time that can reveal a whole different level of patterns about the ways that people are actually working within your organization. So we introduced this tool called Microsoft Graph Data Connect. And we've been working very closely with TalentSoft on the evolution of this tool and the application of this tool. Um, they started working with us on it while the tool was still in uh, preview, so not necessarily generally available yet. And there are really three key tools that we have in the Microsoft Graph Data Connect toolset that are important to understand. The first thing that we do is we build this very robust pipeline that allows you to take data um, at scale and copy it from your Microsoft 365 tenant into Azure Data Factory. So that's the first problem solved is getting the data. The second thing that we like to do is to make sure that the compliance requirements of an organization can be addressed through the fact that we give you very, very granular consent tools as admins to make sure that you give the right data and the right amount of data to an application that's going to process it and discover insights. And then finally, we keep all this data within the boundaries of one Microsoft Cloud, right? We're moving it from Office 365 uh, into Azure. And even though, yes, you can do other things beyond that, the basic idea is that we're letting you keep all this within one company's cloud, one set of rules, one set of guidelines. And that's very important. So now you have this environment where you're able to bring all this data, all this rich data out in a way that lets you manage it, lets you enforce compliance, and lets you combine it with AI tools, with sentiment analysis tools, with machine learning tools, and with other data sets. And that becomes extremely powerful in an HR environment. So I'm going to wrap up by saying this. Um, the thing that's really, I guess, meaningful for me about where we've come with TalentSoft on this is that when we announced the general availability of Microsoft Graph Data Connect, um, it wasn't just anybody that did it. It was Satya Nadella, my CEO, who actually made the announcement. And I think that's because we had a really compelling story to tell, not just about our relationships, but about the customers
members that you know we're looking forward to this technology. And so on that note, I'm going to step aside and let's show a little video that we made uh, for Satya to share with our developer audience. So if you would roll the tape. Telmsoft is the European leader of cloud-based talent management and learning software. We are working with Job, designing an entire new way to recruit and manage highly creative individuals. It's fully based on Microsoft technology. Dior is one of the most recognized luxury brands in the world. The fashion industry moves so quickly, we need to be very agile so that we can really lead the change in the fashion business. My biggest challenge is to nurture creative individuals and to help them work together as a team. Microsoft Grab Data Connect allows us to get data at scale and to identify skills and collaboration patterns across employees within an organization. We are going to use AI machine learning plus data from Microsoft Graph Data Connect to build new teams. Technology and fashion are two different universes. When we bring them together, it's very exciting. The future for me is to leverage all those data from Microsoft Graph to create even more opportunities for job. Thanks to Microsoft, this technology is going to help foster collaboration, discovering talents, and support the work of this iconic brand. The future at Dior is exciting for me because we have the ability to continue to develop all these talented people and working with so much passion for Dior. Okay, that's it. Let me turn it back to Alexander, the man with the voice on the video. Thank you guys. Thank you. See you. Thank you very much, Ben.